Hey y'all, how's it going? <laughs> so we decided to come on back here and take care of this. Oh, there he is. I was like, wait, where is he? <laughs> so let's go ahead and find out what this new area is, eh? Come on, let's go look at that treasure. Yeah, let's do so. <laughs> new game plus time. Maybe the rabbit will be here. Damn it, Sam. Ooh, okay. Ugh, that hurt. Also, I burned the shit out of the roof of my mouth. I made freaking sausages and burnt it. Ah! It might be good to mention, but there's no shame in turning down the difficulty. In this part of the realm, well, things might get more intense. Oh, really? Really? You're saying that at this point, it's gonna get real bad, huh? I mean, I've had it hard this entire time, alright? I'm not about to just quit. Alright, this is the place I was talking about. I know the beast is lurking there. Go and defeat it so we can get the treasure. Who treads on these grounds? How did the human find itself here? Nevertheless, your eyes have seen too much. Oh, good. Make sure I'm recording. Oh, this is where you're at. Jesus. Oh, boy. Son of a. Stupid freaking fox! <laughs> right. Ah, trying this over again. Freaking triple I cat. I just saw what the problem is. He's throwing a little orange thing in front of the skull. Okay, well, here we go. We're, we're gonna get to the solid times for this now. Son of Oh, God. <laughs> we're, gonna have to, we're, we're gonna have to give it a couple shots and then all of a sudden we're just gonna have to cut it. Oh my God, this is... This is new Game Plus boss is just like, hey, you know what? We're just gonna say screw you. Oh, this is this. Is, why did I decide to do this? Why? I didn't finish the game. We were done. I know the thing said you might as well change the difficulty down. But screw you, game. You don't get to tell me what I need to do. Um. <laughs> How long?
was <laughs> I've only been recording for like six minutes and already I hate it. I hate it so much. <sighs> There's gotta be hidden attacks from going from behind those things, man. I don't know why I forgot. There's an attack in front of the skulls, and the skulls do double damage. Why did you forget? Yes, I went to the right. Stupid freaking cat. Like, I know I'm supposed to jump, but when it comes, their brain's just like, no, you're not allowed. I got off the path and I couldn't do anything else. Oh, I'm just gonna have to cut into like bits and pieces of failures. Maybe I should just cut straight to the success. I deflected that one, you son of a. Oh my god. Oh my god. You gone that deep in. Oh, that was the longest one. That was the longest one. Oh, this is gonna take forever. I can't imagine if I took a break. I'd lose so much of my skill. This is taking a lot. I refuse to use change difficulty though.
did it. You have proven yourself worthy. I will allow you to pass. May your quest give you peace. I feel like you could totally kill it. Oh, that takes so much more practice. You know what? I beat it. That, that, that That's all that counts, right? Oh my god. I did it on hard too, you bastards. You actually managed to beat that beast? Great job. I'll go open the door. You could do it too. Uh, I got really close to killing him every now and then, but like, oh god. I haven't locked the door. Come on, hurry. Oh my god. Oh, my arm hurts. Not just my hand, my arm, everything hurts. Ah, death. This must be the treasure. After all these years, I can finally find out. You didn't even know what the treasure was. It's just a dusty old TV. Wait, it's connected to something. I hate you. It's a smegma station. Oh, God. It's Super Racket 2. I didn't know that existed. I challenge you, Red. Let's see which one of us is the best racket fighter. I'm so excited to play. A fantastical creature like that guarding a video game. There must be something special about it. Open the cabin? No. So what's with this? We can get some there to find out. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Even that doesn't give me joy. Oh, the pain. God. Interesting. How crazy is this gonna be? Okay, so yes, you definitely can't miss one. So this is a game about perfection. <sighs> it's fine. I played the vampire. This can't be that much more, right? Let's start doing trick shots. You are, actually. Stop it. I had to open my big fat mouth, didn't I? I just had to open my big fat mouth. Son of a bitch, they use trick shots. Oh no. Nosferatu was just the first. <laughs> this is the real fight. Okay, not a huge improvement, but okay. I'm bored. Let's go do something else. It's gonna unlock it. What's this? What's that cabin? Huh, it's locked. Not a problem for a cat. Haha, <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's a really good lock picker. Oh, yeah, I don't want anything to do with this. See you around, Dolly. Really? Stage right? I don't 
like any of this. I have a choice between these two? Well, fuck. It's the incinerator? What? Oh my god, no, you're joking. Not this again. I feel like that was a little mean. I don't see how you're able to dodge that. Oh, hey, Pink. The body must have broken. Again. Oh, so you are aware. Sort of. No! Stop controlling me! What? Oh, are you aware that you're a pawn? <laughs> so the blind little lamb fell right into the chasm. What do you want? Do you know how long it's been since we last saw each other? I don't know, but I know who you are. You have helped me, Orange. <laughs> Your existence is truly a cumbersome one. I cannot truly imagine what you have had to go through. If you want, my friend, I can give you a temporary escape until I find the permanent solution. If that is what you desire. Is that not what we have always done, Orange? Are you mocking me, Pink? <laughs> Let's go and make your new body, Pink. Okay. Well, we already knew that Dr. Orange made red the, the doll body. <laughs> I hope this one will be sufficient. I think this could work. Thanks, Orange. So wait, though, does that mean... Oh, now it's a yellow body. Yeah, as always, it is hard to know what differences this body will have. We can't know until we try, right? May you rest long, Pink. Thanks, I hope so as well. I hope this will fix me. Maybe you will fix me, Yellow. <laughs> well... It's a duality for Pink. She's both uh, trying to kill everyone, but she also doesn't. <coughs> Yay, we did it! Oh my god, that cat god fight was oh, so hard. I, I, I can't imagine. I could fill an entire video just on that fight alone, but I really shouldn't. I'm gonna be chopping this up. Uh, you know, no, 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 no. This video is not gonna be long enough just that fight. You know what? I'm gonna look up the endings on this. I beat the game twice, all right? I got two endings. I'm gonna look up and see what endings are possible. And we'll get to what we can. Hey, y'all, how you doing? So, <clears throat> I looked up the endings, and I'm both okay and mad. You know, I never did talk to this normally. Door's locked? <laughs> That's why I stopped playing. So, this cat god. That cat god has two endings. <laughs> he has two endings. <laughs> One of them is if you do it the way I did, and the other one is if you kill Do uh, Professor Orange first and then go kill Cat God, something different happens. And then on top of that, there's that weird door to the left. I don't know what that does. Damn it. All right, well. And then there was the gems, which I was correct. I was 100% correct. But. But, but, but. 
I will do the gem ending, but first, there's something more important. Yes. Do you remember when I talked to the Guardian? He was all like, you have to kill me. It's the only way to save everyone. And I was like, nah. Well, guess what, buddy? I was right. That does lead to a certain special thing. I might regret this. Oh, who's, who are you kidding? There is no might about it. I am going to regret this. <coughs> hey, buddy. Oh, yes, here it is. Three per souls. To put it simply, life is suffering. <laughs> Help, I live forever and there's nothing to do. Please kill me. You, you're the only one who can. Do you understand? Do you understand I want to die? Please, I want you to kill me. Damn it! Only you can. You know you want to. Will you kill everyone? No. You must find the courage to both judge and execution. Here's a heavy burden. We cannot wait another eternity for someone else. Now. Shall we battle? No. I see. I cannot know your reasoning, but if you made it this far, I suppose you know what you're doing. You know what I desire. You're the only one who can give it to me. Yeah, nah. <laughs> no. You gave yourself eternal life. You damn well have to enjoy it. Alright. I will force you to have it. Ooh. No, what are you doing? Go and kill the forest spirit. You have to liberate them. You must liberate them. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Gas is getting mad. Why are you not helping? There is no other way. Why are you ignoring us? <laughs> oh, I did not realize that it really was this. The orange mage is hiding in their fortress. I bet. I pulled. So Professor Orange is a mage. He's. Why is there a heaven door? It's all foggy and shit. Going through the store. You'll break your destiny. Are you sure? Absolutely. I'm all about destiny breaking. Foggy path of light and happiness. Who cares about killing, right? We're all about the pacifism route. Let's go to a place where we can all live. Hey, buddy. You spoke of all the guardians. You have seen this world for what it truly is. And yet, you decided not to do anything about it. You think you are such a saint. You're trying to be the good guy. Oh, I get it. You don't want to be a killer. But this is a necessary evil. They are afraid of dying. Only you can help them. Do you understand they are suffering? Yeah. So why aren't you doing anything about it? Now you're too good to kill. Or... Are you curious to see what happens if you don't? Ah, I see. You don't care. You just want to see how far you can push me. Oh, I'll show you. I'll show you how far you can push me, human. I'll show you suffering. Shit. All this time the frog has done tutorials and stuff, he hasn't actually fought fought me. I think he's done. Oh! I think he's done!
This song is so good. No, I know I asked a lot, but you signed the contract. Worthless human. Now, the suffering must continue. You suffer for all eternity. Now make your life a living nightmare. I was complaining about Cat God. This is a step beyond Cat God. Holy shit. Fuck. Yeah, you notice though? I actually got a checkpoint. I'm not gonna be able to beat him HP wise. I'm gonna have to do this the music way. Understand. Oh, I did it. I beat him music wise. I cannot convince the human to kill. He does not understand. It is pointless. Please, I don't want to punish their incompetence. I know what I am asking for. It can be incomprehensible, horrible, or distasteful. Even if I could do it, I would, but it's just. The human just does not understand. Without me telling, I can't wait for another human. I want your help, but I can't do it anymore. Forgive me, my friends. Please. Let me leave this infernal world. Don't worry, frog. You have fought well. You shall have your peace. <coughs> Why does it seem ominous? But as you know, you can never return here again. I understand. Let me come home. Hello, human. You are free to leave whenever you want. The others will continue to live their lives through eternity in their egos, as it has been. Only death can release them. It is how it was intended. If you have come here to receive an ending, I can't give it to you. As you are the ending, you are free to leave, but you can return anytime you like. 
to finish Frog's request. I hope you enjoy your time here. It has been great watching you. Until next time. <laughs> I see. The game's talking to you, the player, not to Red, the, the wooden doll. Oh, you and your crazy nonsense. That was quite intense and not as hard as Cat God. Cat God was so much harder, but that music was so good. Oh, revenge is so good. How do I know it's, re it's revenge? Because everyone in the fucking world loves that song, apparently. Even my friends linked me to it. They're like, look and listen to this song! And I listened to it and like, they didn't want spoilers, but this song sounds good. There it was! So that's three endings now. Well, normal, passive, cat god. I don't want to do the other cat one. It involves me killing. I should. Ah, no. no. It's, it's gonna take too much. I don't want to do cat god again. But what I will do. What? Really? Welcome back, Red. Good luck. Oh my god! You actually start here! Ooh, I'm glad I saved way back when in case I ever want to fight the frog again. So I'm assuming I'm not allowed to go in that door again. Now, you might be wondering, why am I going through the mushroom door? Well, it's because, in my normal save, I didn't get this jewel yet. So, I gotta go to get the jewel. So, let me go get the jewel, and then I'll be where Mr. Blue Guy is. Or at least that's the hope. There's a, there's a small bit of an issue with him, but if I can find him, then I'll explain it. So, I'll see you in a moment. Um... So, I was gonna do the thing, but what is this? What do you wanna do? Lumoth. Oh, hello there. You caught me quite off guard. I sometimes come here and relax. Certainly is a timeless place, a perfect location to unwind. I have a feeling we'll see each other again, human. Goodbye. Uh, what the fuck? That wasn't in any of the other ones. I... Okay. Also, I just remembered I gotta do this stupid freaking jump rope. Alright, well, I'm gonna go get the jewel and then I'll see you at the proper place. <laughs> Alright, hey, we return. Hey, I didn't realize that sign actually says kill now instead of just love. <laughs> oh, what a crazy nonsense this is. Alright, so what am I doing back here, eh? So, according to the endings, there is a chance that that this dude shows up here. It's a small chance, but essentially what you need to do is enter and leave over and over again until he shows up. I don't know how big the chance is, or if I need to leave the entire area. He should be in here. So, let's just see what, when he shows up, shall we? Hey, hey! Alright, hey, so, just a quick at the end of the other one. Yes, he does show up here. He does spawn. However, you need to completely leave the world and come back in for the chance to show up. This world is a shell. It gives me no pleasure to witness this twisted experiment. Alright, well, you dare challenge me again? Sorry, buddy. I need your gem. I remember the lights going crazy though, so. Alright, Scott, Carthorn, Cawthon, whatever. You get it. 
You get the joke. Five Nights at Freddy's, man. Soul Gems. <laughs> now, I wonder what that means. Well, we already figured that out. It's that cat. Although, what I did find out was how the cat works. Uh, the cat only shows up randomly, just like that fucking Light Warrior did. So you have to go in and out every time until you find the... Thank you. Speaking of which, mmm, bring me my eyes. There you go, cat. Please don't be the cat god again. Are you sure you want to insert the last piece? Yes. You insert the aquamarine. You have found new cat god. That doesn't look like cat god. This is gonna be another fucking hard shit fight, isn't it? This is what I get. I want I want all the endings, so I'm basically doing all the end fights. Oh god no. Big ol' epileptic warning. This is a big ol' epilepsy warning.
Oh my god. This is gonna have to wait till tomorrow. This is way too strong. I'm not even happy about this. It took way, way too fucking long for this. Ah, this is a new day of recording, by the way. I <laughs> Oh! Oh, those are self inserts! Chris, you're a dick. You, you, you are the hard one. Jordy's whatever. You! With the crazy lightning bullshit. Oh, this was a newer day recording, and I've been recording for most of the morning. Trying to do this fucking song. And guess what? Fuck that, man. Song's really good, but pff. all you you have to survive the first onslaught part, and then when you get to the second part, then you have to actually just fight, and you just have to loop fight it out. The only hard part, the only real hard part, is when it goes super fast. Uh, I guess I can't end it on that. I really can't. You know what? There's two more endings. I'm not getting the one because that requires you to go down the hallway for four hours. So screw that noise. <sighs> but I can go do the other Professor Orange one. Alright, I'm just gonna go through it. And you know what? I beat Cat God already. I beat it legit. I'm changing the difficulty down to story mode. Hey, y'all. So, uh. <laughs> I had an extra recording in. <laughs> I had an extra recording in uh, Professor Orange, but it's like, meh. Because I, I, I wanted to see if there was an extra thing if I killed him instead of Grundahl first. But I'm deleting that bit. However, the important part that I learned is that apparently if you reduce the, uh, the difficulty, the health bar gets reduced too. What do you know? I can actually kill Cat God normally instead of having a whole god. Scared you there for a second? Yeah, because he died. <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, I guess this was the alternate ending. You really are a special one. You have outdone yourself. You have shown true willpower. Have you come to hear another absolute... That there was only three! Well, here's the final absolute truth. Are you really sure you want to hear an absolute truth? You're already aware of the last absolute truth. It really does not get easier, you know. It's, <laughs> it is life full of contradictions. Are you really sure you want to hear the secret absolute... It's fucking secret. There are several absolute truths. One of them is... Yet, you stand. You are here. You are still here. Why? Is it because of curiosity? Boredom? Pride? Lust? Fear of sins? Skepticism? Stoicism? Journey to... What am I? Don't worry too much about it. This is all going to end up being very funny. You and me will laugh about it for a long, 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 long time. It will be good. I promise you that. Let us see what you have planned for you. There can't be much left in this game to explore, right? Unless, of course, you decide to kill them all again. <laughs> I hope we can see each other when the time is right. Farewell. Like how it acknowledges that you've killed everyone at least once. And hey, what do you know? So I got a secret absolute truth for doing it this route instead of the other route. Although the description from the ending bit made it seem different. You're still here. Is this the final ending screen? Credits. No, not credits! 
Oh, that was just a secret scene! Interesting. She managed to beat that beast. Oh, okay, it's the same thing. Oh, does this mean I gotta beat him in fucking racquetball again? Damn it. Son of a gun. I thought I was free. I thought I was free! Why does it feel like there's more shiny things here? Yep, yep, yep. Find out in a moment. It's Super Racquetball 2! Open the cabin. What you see is beyond words. Hey, let's play some games, Dolly. You see the sort of mad. Other imagery and intricate collage. Somehow it feels personal, but at the same time, it's real. Stop staring inside the closet and let's play some games. As soon as you begin to understand how the visuals move, they change. The longer you look, the more it intensifies exponentially. You see different beings, people you've met, and strange things. Is it trying to tell you something? What does it want? It all collapses into massive fractals and keeps folding and folding. Is it trying to tell you something? What does it want? Is it hypnotic look to it? Fills you with warmth of enjoyment. You almost stare at it forever. So as you think you understand, it turns into something new. Sometimes for the better, sometimes for the worse. You'll always find something new here. Yay, it's the forever cabinet! What? I don't have a choice, I gotta play racquetball too. Yay! Wait, can I just lose and then it be done? Do I have to win? Hopefully not. Hey, cat, it's been a while. I'm on story mode, but I don't think it matters here. Yeah, all story mode really just seems to do is just give you a lower health bar and... You know, give the enemies a lower health bar and give you more health. As far as... Uh, the, the enemies, they're still the same. And I lost. Quit the minigame. Yeah, yeah. That was okay. Not oh, thank God. Not a huge improvement, but okay. <clears throat> yep. Now he's gonna go to the door and be like, Hell no, I'm not going in here because this is the incinerator. <clears throat> not a problem to lockpick for the cat. By the way, I'm not gonna do the final ending. I, I When I looked it up, it told me the final ending is the fucking hallway with the green mage. And apparently it takes four hours. Four frickin' hours. Oh, I'm not allowed to play it properly. Oh, alright. Congrats, you've made it into the incinerator. <laughs> alright, we're gonna have to play that little minigame. Well, it's gonna instantly kill me, so it's not like it's gonna matter. These fucking incinerators. And apparently you can beat the first incinerator. It's like, what the hell? Alright, so Professor Orange is dead. The body must have broken. Again. I will control you. No! Stop controlling me! And it's at this point Professor Orange is supposed to come out. Mmm. He doesn't exist anymore. No. You, you killed them. You killed them and left me here. Why? No! I won't let you continue to kill. I'll just stay here. Alone. Making sure you won't hurt anyone else. Oh, I finally understand. Oh, okay, so... 
Pink is a nice person, but sometimes they would kill. It's essentially, for some reason, every now and then... Pink is a protagonist! Sort so to speak. And every now and then, a human player would control her and would make her kill her friends. That's why they did that! Why they put her in a doll, I guess, is just to help control the power. And then also, hey, put her in a doll, take away her arm, can't kill anyone, right? But then the player's like, I must! And hey, what do you know? That's the final ending, because I'm not doing that hallway. It's four hours of a hallway, and apparently halfway, it throws in rocks. It's not just, I'll tape down the thing and just move on. No, you have to actually work for it. For four hours! No! I refuse! Uh, this is a, this was a good game. The creativity is great. Also, if it's too hard for the dodging and whatnot, don't worry about it. Just change it down to, to story mode. It's fine. All it did was just change how much health you have and how much health the enemy has. As far as the difficulty and the jumps and everything, that's still hard! But I'll tell you what, it made the cat god so much easier. <laughs> you know, it probably would have made the gnomes so much easier too. Man! Ugh. Anyway, that's it. That's Everhood. I hope you enjoyed that. It was definitely good. The music's great. Screw you, you've died. Alright, y'all have a good one. Be safe and all that. Bye!